This building that I'm standing in front of right now used to house an abortion clinic for a little over 25 years. It is this fact that motivated some life-loving people to purchase some land and build a building and open the doors of Hope Resource Center in 1997. The goal then and the goal now was to end abortion in Knoxville. We love this community and God has put us in this community to make a difference and make an impact and Hope Resource Center is going to continue to do that for many years to come because of partners like you. Please join the movement, continue your work as we seek to celebrate life. You give life, you are love, you bring light to the darkness, you give hope, you restore every heart that is broken. I'm in awe of what God has done since 1997 in the doors opening of Hope Resource Center. I'm in awe, but as I drive around this city and this community, I'm reminded of the brokenness that we face every single day and that this population faces every single day. But as I look at the brokenness, I'm, I'm also hopeful. I'm hopeful because lives are being changed. I'm hopeful, I'm, I'm hopeful because we have supporters and partners that, uh, that'll go the extra mile for Hope Resource Center. And in doing so, they're going the extra mile for the citizens of this community. I'm hopeful because women are now being loved. I'm hopeful because babies are being born, families being restored, and people being redeemed. I'm hopeful because these women are walking in our doors, women that have never been loved, women that have been stripped of their dignity, are walking into Hope Resource Center and seeing that they matter. And they're seeing that they're worthy. And it's such a great opportunity because of folks like you that we get to do this work every single day. We drive around this community, we interact with people of this community, and we see brokenness. But in that brokenness, we see hope. And it's an amazing journey that we're allowed to be a part of, to love this community well, and seek to take care of uh, the folks that God has entrusted us with. So I ask you, are you going to join the movement? Please join us in this love work as we celebrate life, as we celebrate family, and as we celebrate women here in Knox. We long to see your face. Come and sing your praise. Just come and have your way. We long to see your face. We come and sing your praise. Just come and have your way. So the question is now, are you prepared? Are you prepared to answer that call with us? Uh, and if you are, then I say join the movement. Come and, and join us at Hope Resource Center with your time, with your money, uh, with your prayers. Uh, we're excited to see what God's gonna do here in Knoxville. We're excited to see what God's gonna do through the Hope Resource Center as we see abortion ended in this community. Thank you. We long to see your face. We've come to sing your praise. Just come and have your way. We long to see your face. We come to sing your praise. Just come and have your way. We long to see your face.